Hello my friends of Qatari Labs, welcome to this tutorial. This tutorial we are going to explore with model viewer a uh, um, Boronoi gridded modflow 6 model. Okay, so what is model viewer? Model viewer is a software for the visualization of groundwater flow models. Uh, is is actually pretty old or well is it has been for some years around it can open uh, mod flow 2000 mod flow 2005 uh, it can open transport models and so on you can create great visualization great 3d visualization with that however here uh, we are going to explore that for the new version that is the model viewer for mod flow 6 and that you download here and then we are going to um, well, we have downloaded as well a Boronoi uh, project that has a Boronoi um, a Modflow 6 model with Boronoi mesh. And we are going to create a practical example of that. Great. So we op um, the Modflow 6 is actually is not doesn't come as exiler, so you have to go here to the bin and then in, just run this M model viewer mf6.exe. Okay, we open that. Okay, and in order to open a modflow model, you have to create new, that is a new project. And here, for example, you can work with the name file or with the data files. Okay, well, let's work with the name file, and the name file will be of the of the model that it will be on the description of the video we go here to output data and gas cancha and then let's go here to model and though we are not going to open the the num of the simulation we are going to open the num of the model in fact okay let's type okay and let's wait a little bit okay let's and then here let's uh here what this is what you are going to see uh the bounding box is not that let's open the grid lines the grid shell and the bounding box is not good uh, it's actually not that interesting to see okay here what you are seeing are the cells that are below the water table okay so these are the cells that are have actually that are saturated and we can plot the heads here as solids and then here if you want a legend a color bar no here no here you can put your color bar here okay uh, then we can also create some isosurface okay so these are the isosurface if you want to alter the isosurface you have to come here this will appear and then for example i want more iso surface i want 15 iso surface and the maximum value will be uh, okay apply so here i have 15 iso surface uh what else i can get uh i can get the model features for example this model has drainage recharge evapotranspiration however recharge and evapotranspiration are uh, all over the model so that's why uh, if those were like kind of delimited chef files it would be faster to or better to to plot it okay great so these are the iso surface we can plot the model features we can well uh, we can the the grid shell the grid the grid we can okay so the grid is by default in the in the bottom of layer five in the bottom of lower layer but we can call we can put it on model top and then let's place us great okay not um, there are some Okay, you can select here for the uh, for the grid for the shell. 
okay well you can select that uh, what else you can do here uh, you cannot in this one what I haven't found is to do a, a crop because okay ah yes we can do crops here let's see so let's see ah but this those are the crops just for the ISO lines not exactly for the grids hmm? okay um, you can export as BMP but there were uh, before in the previous version you can export as VRML that was compatible with Paraview but you cannot do that anymore in this version okay uh, what else uh, you can view you can change directions hmm. Okay, and you can set projection. Well, not not that much. Okay, is is powerful on showing and plotting the results of a Voronoi model. Of a, in this is a this V model. Okay, with Voronoi mesh, with a Voronoi mesh, but I think that it can open as well the unstructured grids or any other sort of grids that allows Modflow six. Okay, so that is the purpose of this tutorial, just to show you the, the potential of Model Viewer to plot your results and hope to see you in coming tutorials and webinars and so on. Have a great day. Bye.